Hi everyone, welcome to ITS workshop. So in the last video we have seen how to perform uh, the operation of put command, how to upload file from local file system to STFS file system. So in this video we want to do it reverse and we have got, uh, we have successfully uploaded this deck of cards.txt file in STFS. Now we want to download any text file uh, from STFS Hadoop file system to local file system. So again, uh, we need two path local file uh, local path and SDFS directory. So we have already given SDFS directory. Now instead of giving SDFS directory, we need to specify for the particular uh, uh, particular uh, path uh, like uh, right now I want to download just this uh, one file so I can give this path and if you want all files you can give directory path so deck of cards dot txt and this is my sdfs path and my local path uh, this time I don't want to save in sample input that is just for input so I have another directory and this is ITS workshop so in home ITS workshop I would download uh, from Hadoop file system so let me copy uh, this path and this is my local path so and it's just let me give this path uh, local path okay and so this is my local path i want to save here and i want to download this particular file which we just uploaded so this time uh, and same uh, we are using configuration object which is getting the configuration properties from xml files and we are using file system instance so file system dot get method is accepting this uri and configuration and it is uh, giving us file system instance so now instead of uh, using this method we have got another method that is fs dot copy and last time we we use copy from local now this is copy to local file so copy to local file now you can see there are different version of this uh, first one is accepting path and path both path source and destination it is not returning anything and this is in file system uh, second one is accepting serialization deserialization and a user information also so we uh, right we'll see this in uh, distributed mode and right now i just would like to uh, go with the simple one so copy to local file and uh, what will be source now this time source will be stfs directory so it accepts a path object so let us give it path object and the string we can give that is stfs directory and we can give destination path object now this time my destination will be local file system so i can give local path and that's it so uh, we want to download in this directory a uh, home trail ids workshop which is empty now and we want to download this file so let us run this program and i have saved it and let me run it. So right click run and run as Java application. It's run successfully. We are not printing any message or anything. So we just can go here and you see in home ITS workshop we got this file which we just created. So you open the file. This is uh, just text file. So we copied it as it is and it was empty now it's copied so it's working fine successfully only two methods you can remember fs.copy from local file and fs.copy to local file then you provide your specific path so whichever path you are using you can provide accordingly so that's it for this and this is uh, this is like get command we use get command for uh, downloading so like sdfs hyphen dfs get so after get we would provide the stfs path and our local file system so same operation we are performing 
and same operation is being performed uh, using Java API. So that's it for this tutorial. If you are liking this series, please click on like button and please subscribe for more tutorials like this. Thank you.